And I started just by making a part on the side of her head and then I'm going to grab another section to braid right here and I'm actually starting it down a little bit further than the part. So you want to part down probably about an inch past your side part and then just come straight across. Okay, with this hair in the back, I'm just going to put it into a temporary elastic for now. And then in the front, I'm also going to part out a small section of hair to leave out from the braid. And I'm putting it in a temporary elastic as well. And then this is the section of hair I'm going to be braiding. I'm going to flip her around real fast. So to begin this braid, you just want to grab a section at the bottom and split that into three pieces. And I'm going to be making a Dutch braid. So these outside strands are going to go underneath the middle strand. And then you're just going to bring in a strand of hair from each side each time you cross under the middle. Now this braid on the picture that I saw was kind of stretched out and I'm going to be stretching out the pieces as I go instead of doing them all at the end like I have done in other videos. Okay, so on the picture that I saw, Kristen Stewart had some hair hanging down in her face, kind of like this. That's not really practical for her when she goes to school and I don't really want hair hanging in her face. So we're just going to pull these back with the braid. Okay, so this is the part of the hairstyle where I'm really just guessing what it looks like. After the movie comes out and I see the back of the hairstyle, it may be completely different than what I'm doing here. But just for simplicity's sake, I'm going to make a French braid. And on the picture, it looks like this part was puffed up quite a bit. So I'm going to rat her hair just a little bit to give it some volume. Not a whole bunch, but just enough that it'll lay a little bit more messy and not so smooth. So I'm going to split this into three sections and begin the braid. And I'm not going to do this tight at all. I'm trying to go for a messy and relaxed look. And I'm taking pretty big sections because that is what it looks like from the side, that there's only a couple of sections brought in. And at this point, I'm going to add the braid in. So I'm removing that elastic. And then also this hair from the front in her bangs area. So really I'm only bringing in like two sections on each side of the braid. It's really not much of a French braid at all. And then I'm just braiding down regularly for the rest of the hair. Okay, so that's the finished style. If you want to go back through and pull this up a little bit and mess it up a little bit more, you can do that so it's more authentic.